After a disappointing stint in the 2018 Asian Games, Maristela Torres Sunang has decided that it's best she hangs up her spikes in front of the home crowd in the 2019 Southeast Asian Games. I'll redeem myself in my last appearance in SEA Games 2019, said Sunang in a text message to Rappeler. On August 27, Sunang leaped 6.15 meters on her first attempt, a far cry from her personal best and Philippine record of 6. 72 meters set in the Kazakhstan Open in 2016. After a no jump on the second try and falling to 6. 03 m on her third attempt, that was it for the 37 year old long jumper. Sunang packed up her things and walked away from the 90,000-seater Jalora Bunkarno Stadium, bidding farewell to her last Asian Games campaign. However, Sunang did not let a recent performance shake up her confidence, revealing that she actually sustained a medial collateral ligament MCL, injury two months ago. After my last competition in June, we endured hard training preparing for the Asian Games and I made a mistake in that hurdles and box jump. That's where I got the MCL sprain. But that was just a slight injury, it's just that I got extra fluid in the knee. Recalled Sunang. With 16 months left in her athletic career, highlighted by three Olympic stints and four SEA Games gold medals, Sunang targets a winning final leap. I'm not happy with my performance, but I'm happy that I'm jumping again and recovered from injury," said the Olympian. I got offered by someone who's willing to help me regain my strength and prevent me from getting injured easily," she added. Future of Philippine long jump at stake. Even before the 2019 SEA Games, the Philippine record holder has been looking for an heir, just like how she was to legendary long jump queen Elma Muro's Posadas. Sunang hopes that she has become an inspiration to aspiring long jumpers among the youth who can eventually surpass the current national record. Of course, I'm still looking for a replacement so that after the 2019 SEA Games, there will be someone else who can participate in the long jump in 2021. She said that when the Olympian turns 38 years old in 2019, it's about time for her to fulfill her dream of spending more quality time with her son. I have a child who I have to bring to and pick up from school because my mom can't handle him. He's too naughty. My mom has been the one taking care of my son because my husband is also working. Said Sunang. But for now, the grind continues for Sunang as she sets her sights on a golden swan song.